we go to Listen, why didn't you tell me from the start that my dad is dead? I don't want to talk about this now. <laughs> Are you going to get some then? Condoms. Yeah, but... Fine. DS Cohen reckons it shares DNA on those red trainers. There's just no way it was her that pushed me down those steps. It just doesn't make sense. Miss Ben knew that you were looking for your father. Yeah. And she was happy letting me waste all that time knowing that he was six feet under. Yeah. And you know, I had this little daydream going on that my dad was going to be this really cool dude, you know, proper funny in there. Not me, but only successful. <laughs> <laughs> Did you ask her anything about it? No, I was too shocked. Well, it's not too late. Miss can still tell you his name, his job. There's photographs, I'm sure. Yes. So you two sneaking off again? Actually, I was just trying to explain that Shaq could still find ways to connect with his father, even though he's died. Did Mum tell you that? You don't look good, love. Oh, thanks, Mum. So glad you're here. Hang on. Shouldn't you be working at the Salon de Té? I will give myself a day off. Hey, I got you some pain of chocolates. Harry. Mum, can you go? <sighs> I knew you'd come. I'm working. Any headaches, nausea? Please don't treat me like your patient. Well, that's what you are. D.S. Cohen says they found Cher's DNA on those trainers. Can't say I'm surprised. She is off the scale, what, with poisoning her dad, gaslighting Mercedes, and she's not your biggest fan, is she? No, 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 I'm telling you, it was Timmy. Why would he do that? Do you actually believe some random over your own girlfriend? But you're not my girlfriend. You're just a liar and a thief. You know, I can't even deal with the drama that comes with you. I can't even be a nurse. If you really believe Cher is innocent, then you do something about it. Because I am done. Jackie's dad was dead. What was the point of us talking yesterday? I know, but I just couldn't do it. I still don't know why you didn't want to tell him about Ali. And I'm not asking. That's your choice. But I'm struggling to understand why you ended up making up a fake story. Yes. I just thought that would end it. But it hasn't. He's going to have even more questions than before. Like, when he died, was he in an accident, was he ill? Are you going to make up a new lie for every question he asks you? I know your intentions are good, but if Shaq did find out the truth, he'd never forgive you. If I was you, I'd undo the lie before it's too late. Concrete. Concrete. Um, <laughs> I think I'm gonna need the hardware store for that one, mate. Bye. So what did you really want to buy? Condoms. Whoa. <laughs> uh, will you get them for me? It's too embarrassing. Man, I don't know, you know. Is that even legal? 
You know, Verity will be out here in a minute. She's just going to get a coffee. Let me ask her first. Oh, man, look, don't look at me like that. I get it, you know, teenage boys and that. But maybe you should talk about it with your parents first. They have. Don't give me one of them cheesy one-to-ones. Oh, that's so mature going to speed to him like that. Props to you, man. Yeah. Down to top, Dad. He isn't even my real dad. Are you lucky to have that relationship? Don't ever take it for granted, yeah? Will you get me the condoms, then? No, nah, mate. Getting condoms for a kid. You're on your own, fam. <laughs> Look, sneak into the dog. They got a machine there, yeah? Your attitude is really starting to grate. I don't know what you're talking about. See, my instincts have served me very well. You're nervous around me. That's why you're making mistakes at work. I made one error. A patient nearly died. You know, and I don't want your behavior impacting on my private life. Mandy appreciates a bit of class. Sophistication, if you will. Oh. Oh, and that's you, is it? Ah. Little green-eyed monster coming out to play, is it? The arrogance is outstanding. I wish I'd you know, never... as much as I'd love to hear the rest of that compelling sentence, I'm busy. Morning. All right. Who was that? Senior doctor. What's he like? Oh, don't know yet. Just started a couple of weeks ago. I need you to talk to me about my dad. I'm heading home now. I'll see you later. Yeah. desperate for the toilet. I had turkey twizzles for my school dinner and it went right through me. Uh. Come down machine's gonna need refilling. Cohen's got it in for me. She accused me of killing George and now she thinks I pushed Juliet down the steps. But you haven't been charged yet. The way she's talking, it's only a matter of time. It's not fair. Just when I try and get my act together and be a better person and it all comes back and bites me in the bum. I know I'll cheer you up. My quiz. Who do you hate? Uh, Julia. Mm, no hesitation there. Yeah, but seriously, what is she on about with those trainers? As if I would wear red trainers. They're so 2018. That's why I sold them to Ripley. Never liked that girl. Speaking of fashion crimes, we're all right for ketamine, thanks. What, have you come to have another go? Well, if you let me get a word in. I've retracted the statement. About the trainers. You got me off. Well, I know you didn't do it. So. They're not investigating you now. Sorry, I'm confused. So. Did you make it up or. No. No, 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 no. The, the person that attacked me was wearing red trainers, but. I pretended that I got confused, so they'd really share. But won't that mean they think you were lying about the whole thing? I guess. 